Hey, hey everyone, if you're wondering, YouTubers, what this is, this is not a VHS, because as you can see, it fits in the palm of my hand, so that's tiny. This is 8mm video cassette, AMP120, this is the US version right here, 8 What's it go to? Well, it finally came in the mail. This is a new open box of Sony's Handycam Digital 8 with a 2.5 inch screen. This came out in 2003, 4, somewhere around there. And the reason why it's brand new, but they call it open box, is because it's already been open. But it doesn't mean it ain't new. You've seen stores that says the same thing all over the world. It's on a shelf. It says new, open box. That means for a cheaper price, you're still getting a new product. Here's all the information, uh, how to operate it and all. All right. This is all your information here. Operation guides and all this stuff. We'll get into that in a minute here. On the side you get power cord. And a USB connector cable. Probably for your computer. So you download this on computer. And RC, known as RCA cables, also known as audio video cables. And here's the adapter that the uh, power, co power cord plugs into, and the other end of this into your camera that recharges the battery. Now we're going to set even deeper the box. As soon as I figure out how to get into the deeper of the box. You should have to grab it like that. Get that open. And then, I don't know what that's for. And there it is, some more stuff. Nifty, uh, looks like a shoulder strap, carrying a strap or something with the logo Sony on it. And looks like you got a new uh, remote control to go with the camera. Can quarter. And down in here has got to be in this uh, if I see it down in the white box it's got to be the uh, battery. In this little box it's got to be yeah, this has got to be a rechargeable battery. Bring that way down there. This here is looks like turned around is with the name of Sony on here. I don't know if you can see it or not. This is your lens cover cap for the lens cover of your camera, and this big huge thing here. Should be the camcorder itself. Set it right there. That should be everything, as far as I know. There it is, ladies and gentlemen. If I don't, isn't that beautiful? Kind of still hard to hard to open up here for some reason. Alrighty. And on the back here is the compartment for the battery. This is the back of the camera. It's already lighting up. Look at that. No, I'm just kidding. Now there's the screen tilt all the way back toward the front of the camera, like it does on my handycam. 
uh, um, this camera that I got back a few years ago. Let's see, I don't want to break it. Yes. It does, just like the Handycam. How about that? No, they made that for video. But on my other Handycam, which is the mini DVD brand, it does the same thing. It even goes, huh, goes all the way around. I don't know why you want to look at it like that, but it's nice to know that it goes all the way around. It plays on high eight and slash eight millimeter playback, which is this tape here that I was showing you. I don't know what's on here. Probably something old and ancient. <laughs> Spring 2010. Must be home movies. You know how it is with videos going ahead back in the day. Nothing but home movies almost. Home movies. But anyway, I'm going to put that in there and see what it looks like. Because it does say playback on here. Tilt it where you can see it better. Okay, we can see it better this way. Also has memory stick capability and touch panel LCD. They thought about that back in 2003 or 2004 with this model. Cool. It's a touchpad screen. Huh. Okay, I guess it is. What it says, it must be. Okay. Close this up. I'm not going to try to make too much of a long video here. So here's the functions on this side. Display. Battery info with this button. And if my camera zoom in or clear up, I mean, easy. Is that for erase? I don't know what easy is for. Let's push and see how easy everything is. Yeah. This is digital eight. Steady. What's that shot? There we go. Steady shot USB streaming. Huh. Okay. Let's go back here in the back now. Now I think this lens pops up for you to. Yes. Just like that. For easy viewing better when you're looking through the viewfinder. Okay. I don't know what that's for. Okay, let's see the function back here. Charging light right there. Camera switch is right here somewhere. Or maybe these buttons is what it is. Okay, bottom button. Play, edit, memory, tape, camera. Now, what else does it have over here on the back? Some more controls. You got light button at the top there. Uh, pre R, is that pre R O for program? One of these cameras want to go out and zoom on their own. I don't know. And you got backlight button, memory stick. Oh, is that where I can put my uh, SD card in there? I was hoping it uses SD card features at that time. Well, cool, cool, cool. I didn't know they had that feature for videotape back then. Let's see, over here you got power. It's like it's off right now, charging. Push down for on. All the way down, it looks like it says for mode, and then you got the record button. Start and stop. Okay. DCN. Okay, just so you, I have to cut that off eventually. You can use either kind of videotape. High 8, which I don't have yet, or the 8mm, which, which I do have. 
So it can play not only those two kind of tapes, but it also plays the brand new, um, uh, where's it at? Digital 8 tapes as well, which I also don't have yet. So it plays three different standards. I guess you'd say that this camera is backwards compatible, as they would call it, I guess. So you can play three different types of video. I'll have to do that. I'll have to get some of those next time on eBay or whatever. Okay, let's go around here real quick. What does that say? Digital video cam camera recorder. Okay. D8 for digital 8 is what this model is. That's the palm shoulder where the back of your hand comes through. And at front, oh, it's got a built in on light right here. Okay. You don't have to add any stuff on top. How about that? Has its own video light. It looks like LEDs, which is good. Right here is probably your infrared sensor there for your remote. Down here, if I can read it close up. Let's see. Let's see if I can zoom in. S video. Oh, this pops out. If I can that's where your S video plugs into. All right. Okay. There's your zoom lens. Optical up to 20 times. 990 times digital zoom. And down here is your stereo speaker. I guess we play the tapes to the, to the machine here. All right, I guess that's about it, about this camcorder. I think I showed pretty much all the functions. There's one right here. Night Shot Plus, off and on. Night Shot Plus. That must be this thing right here. Okay. I'll read more about it here in a minute. And of course, down at the bottom, nothing much except yeah, places where you can screw this onto the uh, tripod, pretty much. I think you get two different tripod uh, screws here. You got a black one and the metal one here. And this is the uh, remove the battery pack, I think. Can't read it that way. It's upside down. I can't read it. Open, eject. Oh, okay. What does it open and eject? I don't see anything. Oh, okay. Over here. This is probably where your tape goes in. But it didn't do anything when I did that. Sounds like it did it somewhere. <laughs> where does it open up at? Oh, okay. The bottom part opens up to check. Okay. All right. Oh, I don't want to put this in the wrong way, so I might have to read up on it. Well, let's see where the inside cogs are at. Usually can tell that way. I may have it going the right way. Oh, here it is. Do not push this part do not push so you don't push it it does it by itself well i got the slam in there now there it goes now it's locked in and then i guess you take it like this hmm
Oh, you push it in the top and it locks it in. Well. <laughs> then I guess you just was not doing anything. All right, folks, I'm not going to mess it up, so I don't know really how it goes, really. Go like this, but I'll have to read up on it. All right, that's it for now. So I read up on it. Ciao.